Hi guys! In this video, I'm going to show you how to find the surface area and the volume of pyramids. To find the surface area, we need to find the area of the base, which is a square, and the area of a square is b to the power of 2. We also need to find the area of each side of the pyramid, which is a triangle. And so the base of the triangle is B, and the height of the triangle is S, or the slant height. So how many sides are there to a pyramid? There is one, which is this side, two, three, and four. So there are four sides, or four triangles in total, in the pyramid. Now, the area of one triangle is one half times the base times the height of the triangle or the slant height which is s since there are four triangles in total we need to multiply by four so four times one over two is two and this is the surface area formula for the pyramid which is b squared plus two times b times s. Let's say that the base is 10 centimeters, the height is 12 centimeters, and the slant height is 13 centimeters. What is the surface area? So we can use this formula, and we know that b is 10, so we can substitute the number 10 into b here and here. Now s is 13, and so over here, 10 to the power of 2 is 100. And over here, 10 times 13 is 130. And 130 times 2 is 260. And so the surface area is 100 plus 260, which is equal to 360 centimeters squared. And that is the surface area of this pyramid. What is the volume of a pyramid? Well, the formula is 1 over 3 times the length, times the width, and times the height. And if you watch my previous videos, you know that this part right here is the volume formula for the rectangular prism. And so if you take a pyramid, and you put it inside a big rectangular prism, you will see that the volume of the pyramid is one-third of the volume of the rectangular prism. And so that is why there is the number 1 over 3 in front. Now, why is it 1 over 3 and not 1 over 2 or 1 over 5? Well, you need calculus to find this number, and you won't learn it until you're in college, right? So for now, the volume formula of the pyramid is one over three times the length, the width, and the height. So the length is 10, the width is also 10. So 10 times 10 gives you 100, and the height is 12. So 12 times one over three gives you four, and four times 100, is 400 and so the volume of this pyramid is 400 centimeters to the power of 3. Thank you so much for watching this video. Now can you try one yourself? Go ahead and find the surface area and the volume of this pyramid and then put your answers down in the comment sections below. So I'm going to give you a hint. You need to find the slant height in order to find the surface area. And you need something called the Pythagorean theorem to find the slant height. So if you have a right triangle, which is this triangle here, that is the right triangle, you can use the formula a square plus b square is equal to c square to find this slant height. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like it, please hit the like button and also don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this.
with that being said, I hope you guys have a good day, and I'll see you guys in the next video.